So, <clears throat> starting today a little bit earlier, um, yeah, I'm going to upload this to YouTube. Yeah, that makes sense. I haven't uploaded something to YouTube for quite some time. <laughs> Since most of my Might Magic twice are like, Oh God, I'm getting popped, fucked all the time, please don't. So, yeah. Um, blah, 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 blah. How is everyone? Hi Backfront Woos, hi Asriel, hi, uh, how is it called? CPC Gamer! Ah, hi Doomsday Man. How is everyone? I hope you guys are doing great. I am doing quite fine. A little bit tired, but what's new? <laughs> um, a little announcement. I am not going to stream tomorrow. I am not going to stream Thursday. Tomorrow, because I have some, uh, yeah house work stuff to do and Thursday because uh, two of our interns leave and two we have two new interns and they are doing a cocktail party I am not really that fancy of cocktails but yeah I should I should attend this I should attend this just to let you guys know so yeah Okay, um, we are going to play the remake of Shadowgate. I hope it's going to be... Yeah, it should be uh, fluent. I highly doubt that this game is like, Oh God, I can't play this. I can't stream this. Yeah, free food. Yeah, it's cocktails. Uh, CPC game is pregnant. Yay! Pregnancy hype. I'm happy for that. I didn't pop out my chat, so I have you guys next to my screen. That is strange. Okay, um, yeah, let's play Shadowgate. <laughs> Since I kind of fucked up yesterday in twenty-five, in the twenty-five years that I'm playing this game. Well, it's more like twenty-seven years, to be quite honest. Fuck, I'm old. <sighs> Why do they have to put this TM here? Why? Shadowgate TM. This is like the Nintendo stuff. Like we have this awesome in intro and then TM. Kind of ruins the mood. Uh, do we have any options? I need to... Uh, resolution looks good. Achievements, quick save, items, archive, outfit, outfit? Spells? Okay. I know what trademark. I know that it means trademark. I just want to know why it's there. I'm fairly certain that it is unlocking all achievements. Whoa! I need to 100% this game. Successfully beating the game and defeating the Warlock Lord for the first time. Completing Master Mode in 1,000 turns or less. Completing Journeyman Mode in 2,000 turns or less. Uh huh. Curing yourself of a curse in 500 turns or less. What's the retro mode settings? There's a retro mode? Ooh, retro mode! Audio, text, transitions. Oh. I don't know, do. Nah, let's. Ah, nah, let's not do retro mode. Your settings have been safe. Let's do. Return. Ah, there. Let's do it like it's supposed to be, and then I can just replay it! Ah! Let me, one second, adjust my chair. Wonderful. Ah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. New. Choose your difficulty. For casual adventurers. Contains harder puzzles and less forgiving gameplay. Yeah, apprentice. For first time adventurers. Contains the easiest puzzles and most forgiving gameplay. Or master. For experienced adventurers and closest to the classic world. Contains the hardest puzzles and least forgiving gameplay. It's not the same. I think they... It is in the same setting. It is in the same castle. But I think they changed. Quite a few things. Let's do master. Let's do master play with tutorials. Yeah. Yeah. I am the master! The master of disaster. A hero's journey? A great quest? Hmm. Certainly it shall be these things. 
But for you, young Jair Kathaka, soldier of Windermere, could it not be so much more? In dreams, I have come to you. Ugh. Beseeching, entreating. Ride south, boy. Take naught but a dirk, a torch, <laughs> courage. Ride south from Rivelin, around the southern arm, through the Waven Fairwood, past Myrithath, beyond the citadel of Murnak Tor, and the spires of Gimdane, and the darkness of Tarketh's Pass. I already don't know where I have to go. There you shall find my stone in wait. Under the shade of the mountain range, none have entered. Either on foot, on mount, on wing. I have a tablet. Gatekeeper, the oldest of spires. It harbors that which has been spoken of in whispers and ascribed to legend. Shadow Gate. The living castle. The living. But all is not as it should be. One of our own is now our great bane. A blight upon us. He has brought the ancient keep low. And it now lies fallow. It is there that you will find me. Blackmere of the Circle of Twelve. It is there that you will find this great quest. It is there that you will find yourself. <gasps> okay. Looks promising. Do we all ask? <laughs> hey you, it's me, the Skull. Click on the take command above and then click on me. Okay. Thanks. I've been stuck here for ages. You can call me Yorick. I'll be up here on your left from now on. Oh, please don't. You will notice that there are a number of buttons running along the top. These are the commands you can perform on everything in the adventure. Just click a command and an item and you're on your way to completing your quest. Yay! Look down there, where I was laying. It looks like a key. You should probably take that. Yeah, that makes sense. I took it. Game. Okay. You put the key in your satchel. Items that you take are stored in your inventory. Click on the satchel in the lower left to view your inventory. Ah. It looks like there's something under the woods to the right. You will have to cut through them to get to it. You have a dirk in the in items tab of your inventory. First click on the dirk, then click the use command. Then close the inventory for finally clicking on the woods. Okay. You have found a helm. Okay, take the helm. You see the portrait over the top right? That's you, or thyself. <laughs> You can equip the helm you just found by first clicking on the helm in the outfit tab of your inventory, then clicking on the use command, and finally clicking on thyself. Uh -huh. Items that you are equipped will show up on thyself. Equipped items will also be shown with a shield behind them in the outfit tab of your inventory. Okay. The use command then can do a lot of different things. Try the use command on the key you found earlier to unlock that door. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Perfect! Now that the door's unlocked, you just need to open it. Now that the door open, go it. Can I, can I click on my... I want to click on thyself or myself. It's a bit dark in here. Do you see your torch in the lower right corner? Use your torch in the leftmost torch in the room to light it. Click, click. Oh. Ah. Let's take the torch. Oh! So I dropped the lit one. Ooh. Hi, hi, Nana. Uh, I'm playing on Master. I'm playing on Master. Now that you can see what you're doing, that lever looks important. Use thyself on the lever to operate it. 
Ah, the first, it's, uh, there are differences already, there are differences already. Yeah, I played yesterday the, um, the, the Amiga, with, well, original, it was on the Mac because of the adventure, but I, I knew it from the Amiga. So, yeah, you will need to use thyself on many things in Shadowgate. When you use thyself on an object, how you interact with it will depend on what that object is. You might provide it where it search it or directly interact with that object in some other way, like the lever you just pulled. Look, you found another. Okay, you all have to figure out what this one goes on your own, but before you continue, there are just a few more things I want to show you. Uh, the parchment down in the left corner next to your inventory is your map. A map? Okay. Your map keeps track of everywhere you've been, as well as any interesting things you might have seen. Click on the X to close the map. Okay. Ah, I can zoom. Holy shit, that's how huge. <laughs> uh, the back button, the back button will take you to the room that is behind you. Okay. You can always speak to me if you need some advice. Okay, let's take the key. Is there anything else? <laughs> You're still con Yurik. Wait, can, can I save? I want to save. Save game, empty slot, yeah. Empty slot is always good. Your game was saved. Okay. Can I kill myself? Use on myself. Are you sure you want to go through your suicidal inclination? Yes! Yes! <laughs> you thrust the dirk into your belly, twisting it sharply as a dishonored warrior might. The pain is intense, but mercifully fades as your life's blood spills to the ground. Click to continue. So you can actually kill yourself in this game. It asks first! You have chosen poorly, young dear. Putting that jerk in your belly wasn't the smartest idea. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> oh, what? No, dun 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 oh. I am... I'm sad. What is this? Look. It's difficult to if the sling has been seen battle or was simply used as a... Ooh, that's the sling. Ah, perhaps we need to kill the... Uh, what's the face again? The Cyclops again. The circular hatch is made of a strange stone that's secured within a mortar base. A low hum of... Horrible. Hum of power emanates from within. Can I open this? Despite the best efforts, you cannot open the hatch. It seems magically sealed. Interesting. How about we take... You can't take something you already possess. That is deep. Can I take the... Thanks. Good! I guess I need to use this key on that door. Ah. You struggle with both hands to turn the key in the starboard lock. A satisfying... Click! Echoes through the chamber. Well, let's see. The door easily swings open. Oh! Hi. Blackmere was a fool to send a child to do that which even the vaunted Circle of Twelve could not. Contain my growing power. Come if you wish. It makes little difference. Seal your fate within this living castle of the dead. What? Not laughing? Whoa. Anyways. A strange presence fills the room. In a flash of fire, a pair of glowing eyes fills the chamber. Next to your devilish voice in your head, blah 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 blah. Yes, we already made ahead this. The apparition wings out, leaving a cold trail behind it. <gasps> a dead body. I wonder what killed him. You should search, search his remains. He won't mind, and sometimes you can find useful items and corpses. Open or use thyself on the corpse. <laughs> yeah. let's, let's open the corpse and not use myself on it. You pat down the corpse. Your rough handling produces sound of cracking bones as well as a piece of parchment, which you put in your pack. Look on that altar. That's not just an ordinary book. You can learn spells by reading certain books and scrolls. Go on and open this one up and see what it says. Okay. Something shifts under your feet as you open the book. Ah. 
This particular book comes with a strange power. Let's read what is written. Look at the book. You learn a spell. The spells that you learn are stored in the spell section of your inventory. Oh! Click the satchel icon to open the inventory. Then use the spell tab at the top to switch between sections. You scan the ancient manuscript notes making most of the language unintelligible. However, one particular word stands out from the west. Invokan. In your mind's eye you see a glyph glowing with power and quickly write down the strange marking in your spell book. Hi, will to the rescue! You have learned a spell. Okay. There's your new spell. Every spell does something different. It will only work when cast on certain items or in certain places. Uh, and don't you torch it in zero to nine. Control and one. Okay. Now, anytime you want to use the spell, you can press the one number key to select it. Try using your new key binding to cast a spell on the statue. You concentrate on the statue and whisper a word of power. Although your spell is powerful, it bounces uselessly against the cold dead stone. Hmm. It looks like that spell is meant to be used on something else. Look on the ground by the statue. Books aren't the only things to read around here. I wonder what that scroll says. First open the scroll and then look at the scroll. Oh, really? I know how to use verbs. <laughs> a message from Lakmir. It sounds important. We can't risk this formation falling into the hands of the Warlock Lord. Memorize this message, then burn the scroll. What? Use your... Ah! You read the message scrolled in the scroll. Fend will. This missive is of utmost importance. We must coordinate our efforts. Seek my obelisk in the accolade, then below the sewers. I fear the worst is upon us, but I have plans in motion that may yet avert disaster. It is signed with the name Lakmir. Use your torch on parchment. Double click a command to lock it. You can then perform that command multiple times without deselecting it. Right click to select a command or object. Okay. Ah, if you want me to quiet down, just hit me upside the head. Yeah, let's do this. Fuck off. Ah. Load and save. Yeah, you have your own from here. Oh, I'm on my own from here. Wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> Let's save again. Yeah, <laughs> just made some new spirits. <laughs> Let's take that book. Let's see what happens if I do this. Oops. As you lift the top from the altar, the earth rumbles beneath your feet. In an instant, the rock floor gives way, sending you tumbling down a long vertical shaft. While the abrupt impact from the landing doesn't kill you, ten tons of stone from the broken floor finish the job. Ouch. That, that kinda hurt. Tis a sad thing that your adventures have ended here. This a sad thing that your adventures have ended here. That sounds familiar. Oh wait, it is actually from. Uh... Isn't that from what the original shot? We zoom. Oh, why did you guys not like the screams? The ten minute screams. It makes makes total sense. I don't know what you want. Anyways, um, take take all the take all the uh, torches. I need more torches in my life. Uh, you put the torch in the section. Huh. Yorick sarcastically quips. Even you will know when the place is powered up. Glows like pretty blue gems. What? Strange markings and glyphs line the stone pillar that enshrouds the statue. One that depicts a hooded figure with a darkened visage. Uh -huh. Eat a eat a body. Okay, eat a skeleton. Your grandfather would warn us grave if he knew you were coming, contemplating cannibalism. Is it cannibalism when I eat bones? Well, most likely. Oh, what is this? It looks interesting. It is nothing. Okay. Uh, a damp, musty breeze wafts out from behind an altar set within the stone alcove. You notice that the long hallway continues further into the mountain. Is there some secret uh, stone somewhere? Oh! <laughs> Use! 
Oh, oh, you stone. Haha! You put your shoulder against the stone and pushed. The rock fractures and crumbled inward, revealing an opening. <laughs> it is just like the Amiga game! <laughs> Let's go there. At least in the Amiga game you have to go there first. Oh. <clears throat> you forced yourself through the narrow opening and into the darkness beyond. A f oh, hi. There's something. A figure moves this in the opening at the back of the grotto. You hear the unmistakable twang of a longbow, followed by the whistle of an arrow. Ow! Oh. The silver-tipped arrow buries itself to its fletching within your chest. Looking down in shock, you slowly slump to the ground, gurgling a few times before the darkness takes you. Is this game linear? I have no idea. I guess it's the same as the original Shadowgate. Tis yeah. a sad thing 